Yes then guys, how are you doing? My name is Morsi and welcome back to my channel. It is that time of the week, Wednesday is here and oh my days, the content is going to be huge tonight. We've got a brand new team of the week, but that's at the bottom of the barrel. Obviously we got a new silver star and that is why you're here, but we're also getting icon swaps dropped out of nowhere. Well, the leaks have been around for a while. People have known it's coming, but they didn't know when. And out of nowhere last night, we get a, a little loading screen for icon swaps. And uh, yeah, that's going to be crazy. So a lot of content to grind for objectives, SBCs, get your icon swaps, get some crazy packs over the next couple of days, guys. And yeah, a brand new promo as well on the weekend. So it is mental in FIFA 22, plenty to do. But last week's Silver Star, our man Vite didn't really wow the crowd. I mean, it's a very, very decent utility player. It's a fullback in the left back position. We yet to have a Silver Star in that position as of yet, which is nice for unique kind of hybrids. However, there was no real wow factor with the card. This week round, I am hoping for big, big things. And I've seen leaks. I've seen Adeyemi. I've seen potentially Conor Gallagher for Crystal Palace. who deserves that Silver Star. He's the main one I'm hoping for. You're going to see the team that I'm using to unlock her, the brand new Silver Star in a second. And it's kind of built around that man. Hopefully, he's going to get it. So the time is here. What are we saying? Oh, they've only gone and done it. Yes, the boys. They have only gone and done it and released Gosset. GG, GG. I believe the man played his last game since the end of an era card. And it looks fantastic as a box to box centre mid. I am hyped. I like that they've kept the image as it is. To be fair, maybe they will add a dynamic. I'm not too sure. But this man's an OG. Anyway, to unlock this man, it is the usual win three matches, score eight, and assist six in Silver Lounge. So let me go show you the team that I'm going to use to get my hands on him. But the team I'm going to be using to get my hands on the brand new Silver Star is pretty much my best Silver team as it stands. These are the boys that if I had to do a Silver little wager, I'm using these lads right here. Ramsdale is in goal, the best Silver keeper I have used by far. Yes. The Arsenal bias is there. By the time you're watching this, it's probably six goals down to West Ham as we play later on today. But for me, Rambo Ramsdale is the best silver goalkeeper I have used. And the English Premier League defenders this year round. Obviously, we got um, our hands on a bit of a Phil Jones you're going to see in a second. But Axel Twins is in here. And if you don't have the Phil Jones SPC, 100% would recommend Mark Gahey. He may go up in price if Conor Gallagher is the silver star as he is a hyperlink to the man. But this boy right here holds his own. But for my squad personally, we're going to mix it up and we're using the player moments. I mean, you could play this guy at front if you wanted to, but we'll be sensible for now, Philly Boy Joe. This trio is probably one of my favourite silver trios at the back so far. Similar with the German boys, Klunter and what's his name, Maxim Leitch and uh, Sippeling Goal. Those are probably my go-tos, but I do prefer this one. Twanzebi every single year is a ridiculous silver card. I mean, he's better than what he was last year. And last year, he was pretty much prime Rio Ferdinand level. Now, I left that with staying in the Premier League, but we are breaking away from the English theme. And once again, the Arsenal bias is there. It's my boy, Nuno Tavares. Arsenal's very own Jao Cancelo. Mikel Arteta just wanted to play like Cancelo. He misses, he misses Man City, let's be real. I don't blame him. The quality of the players that Man City have... But every time this man's on the ball, he's trying to do something crazy. A couple of step overs, break away, try and score 15, 40 yarders per game. And he is in my team. Pace, he's solid. He's a very good fullback. I just want him to get a silver star, I'm honest with you. And he allows me to get in a silver star, and that man is Dennis. I didn't really get on with his card too much when it first came out. I was a little bit let down. I loved his normal silver card at the start of the game. I expected big, big things, but now he's easing up on me. He's starting to turn up. The dribbling is ridiculous. The agility is insane, and his finishing is super damn solid. And what's fantastic about this man is he gets a brilliant little hyperlink into a certain Nigerian Watford player who I believe is injured in the real world. I would, just, would love to see more of him, but he's probably my favourite centre mid in the silver game mode it is a Tabo. high high work rates obviously these boys get a hyperlink which makes it fantastic for hybrid squads which is basically what i do with my silver teams i like to mix it up and have as many different alleyways as possible in my squad so having these two here is happy days all round and most importantly he's a bloody baller now in the center midfield position i don't actually have this man in my club but hopefully by the time you're watching this he has a silver star and it is a juicy little upgrade on this 74 overall card obviously he's already 74 overall so he may get a gold team of the week but hopefully not it is his time please ea hook us up with a silver star gallagher now let's take a little break from the premier league for the rest of this squad we're going to mix it up a little bit now right back and right mid in a 4-5-1 is fantastic because you can get in pretty much uh, any silver star on the right hand side like Dodo, Olsen and Leon, as long as you get a strong link into him. But for this one, we're going to use a centre mid on seven chemistry 
And if you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, you will know how much I love this chap right here. It is our boy Moses. Now this man is not a silver star. He is available on the market and I believe he's going for about that 15K price. Or has he gone up a little bit? He's getting price fixed a little bit, the less he's been on the market, obviously. But this build right here, for example, wait until he's on an open bid. He might be able to pick him up for about 15K like I did. But this man is a baller. Uh, three star, two star, nothing really to shout about. But overall, an absolutely insane striker. One of my favorite players to use up front. And he gets a nice strong link into a silver common card. Uh, in the same league, the same nationality. And he's actually really damn solid, to be fair. The Norwegian boys repping it this year around. It is our boy Lines. Pace, decent dribbling stats, decent stamina. Yeah, a decent gaze. So two spaces left in my squad right now, guys. We're going to go back to the English roots, and we are using a lad he plays in the championship. Now, a lot of you will instantly know who I am linking up up top to this chat, but it is our boy Rinim Hotter. Now, this man and Atebo are so damn solid together. The links are fantastic. Holding down the midfield, bossing it in a 4-3-3. Have a Gallagher, the more attacking out of the three. Use these boys to sweep up behind defensively. Ridiculously solid. And most importantly, another cheeky player moments SPC during uh, was it the Black Friday promo. Where is player moments card, man? I swear, there's so many different types of cards on this game. I'm all over the place. It is our boy, DD boy. Dean Dog himself. Absolute brute up front. I use him as that out and out striker with Dennis and Mara either side in a 4 3 3 slash 4 3 2 1 with his team. If you don't have Dini, there are different options. You can use Grant, who's a championship striker, English as well. He does a solid job. I have used him a couple of times, but for me, it has to be Dean Dog. And this right here is my current favourite team. Oh, probably, yeah, probably favourite team, even though it's my favourite silver team. My favourite team of FIFA 22, guys. Let me know what you think down below. These will be the boys that I'm going to use to unlock the brand new silver star tonight. If you come up against me, drop me a message. Let me know what's up. Let me know you watch these videos. I'd love to see it. But either way, guys, I hope you did enjoy. I'm going to go unlock the silver star, and I'll catch you very soon for a replay of you. Take it easy.